In light of this recent development in the Bahamar saga, a news team went to the streets today to find out what the Bahamian public thought about government paying the salaries of Bahamas' foreign staff members. No, I don't think the government should be responsible for paying uh, the foreign workers. Actually, that was something that was in my head um, during the debate that they say that they need to pay the Bahamian or pay the workers. But I don't think the foreign workers should be inside that package at all. For foreign workers, no, because foreign workers, they come over, they're supposed to be for the workers, whoever paying them. If they, someone else bring them in, you see, like we bring them in. If they come from somebody else, they're supposed to be get paid from the person who bring them in. Well, when I think of government payout, I always think that it's going to fall on me, the taxpayer, at some point. I am not responsible for foreign workers, right? So, no. I don't believe they should be paying uh, salary for foreign workers, uh, but, but for human workers, or foreign workers, because they didn't employ them. I don't think we should do it. I don't think so. And plus, uh, they made their mess, so they should clean it up themselves. Why the government should should get involved? It's not the government obligation to pay the foreign workers. That's the owner's responsibility. So I mean, I think that the company that was responsible for bringing the people in should be responsible for paying their salaries. So why can't the owner pay them? That's why it's weird. I mean, you can't expect to bring somebody in from some place and uh, I can we gotta pay them, but then we didn't bring them in. You bring them in. And if you all have a problem with the money, that means you could try to put it back on us, that can't work. I don't think that if the government is doing a buyout for local workers, that they should be responsible for that. The government is not responsible for 80 expat payments. The developer should be responsible for those. Definitely not the government, which will fall back on me, the taxpayer. No.